do it. Hey guys, this is Versatile from VST Power. So in today's video tutorial, I want to show you how simple it is to use a PS2 Slim and using a Swap Magic. So what I have right in here is a Swap Magic Disc 3.6. This is actually the DVD version. And when I turn it around, this is what that disc looks like. It's a silver press disc. Likewise, I have the Swap Magic. This is the CD-ROM version 3.6, and that's what the backside looks as well. So you can use these to play your backed up games. Now, granted. In today's tutorial, I'm using a slim PS2, so that's my slim PS2 down there, and I also did the tape straw and tissue mod. If you don't know what I'm talking about, please go see the other video tutorial that I did that shows you how to do that procedure. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this swap magic into the PS2, and let's turn it on. And with the lid open, you can see that my disc is spinning. That's how you know that I have done the tape tissue and straw mod correctly. So let's go back to the TV. Wait for a second or so. PlayStation 2. Now the disc has stopped spinning uh, momentarily here. There we go. Sweet. So what we're going to do is I have a backup game today. It's called Gradius 5. So this is what it looks like. Burnt copy. Gradius 5. It's on the DVD. So let's go ahead and swap out the swap magic. Like so. Put the game in. People don't believe me. So let's go ahead and press X. It's spinning. Great. Let's go back to the TV. And the game will load momentarily. Now I have free McBoot so I have to take out my memory card momentarily so that the game will start correctly and then I can go ahead and put the memory card back in in a second once we get to the memory card screen which I'll show you here. So it says, oh, you got no memory card. That's fine. So let's go ahead put in my memory card like so. Go back. Sweet, the game has started. So if you don't know, Swap Magic is a utility disc that you can use to play your back though games. It works in all types of PS2s, the slim and the fat. So it doesn't avoid your warranty per se, but you do have to do, if you have the slim PS2, you do have to open up your PS2 um, in some methods if you want to do the tape mod, tissue mod, and the straw mod to block the three or two door sensors depending on your PS2 version. And of course the game is going to run full speed just like I would expect it because it's running off the disc. So that is the tutorial for today. If you like this type of video, please like, favorite, and subscribe so that hopefully one day we can get to the front page of YouTube. Otherwise, if you have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on our YouTube page and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.